Welcome back everyone. Three of the greatest words finally or it's finally Friday and it's a little bit warm to start this Friday afternoon. We've been seeing some passing clouds from time to time. We should see more sunshine as the day goes on. We're now starting to see some winds in some spots from the southeast. Other places seeing easterly winds uh, shouldn't be terribly humid for today, but the humidity increases for tonight into Saturday and Sunday, and it's a tad breezy out there. Winds from the southeast at 12 miles an hour in Westlaco with a gust of 17, a gust of 23 in Brownsville at this time. Temperatures right now in the lower 80s in Edinburgh and McAllen. We're in the upper 70s in Westlaco and Brownsville, 81 degrees in Rio Grande City. So it's mainly sunny for this afternoon and a little bit on the warm side, 83 at 3 p.m. 79 at 6 p.m. Not too, too humid for at least mid afternoon. We're down to 72 degrees at 9 p.m. It cools off with a few more clouds later on this evening, but should be a nice cool overnight for this Friday night. Let's talk about the forecast for uh, the AACA car show in downtown Harlingen tomorrow. Uh, not too bad. We're starting off in the mid 70s at 10 a.m. Mostly sunny skies, though it is going to be breezy for tomorrow. 81 is your temperature at noon and then 84 degrees at 2 p.m. So here's a surface map. We have high pressure at the surface. The big blue H centered over northern Louisiana. And so we're getting winds from the east and even southeast of the surface here in the valley. Aloft we have a ridge of high pressure, a stable air mass that is a building into northern Mexico and Texas. We are seeing some higher clouds uh, coming in from the west. And here are the temperatures all around Texas. It's a mild early Friday afternoon. Not too bad temperature wise. 70 in Odessa, 69 Del Rio, 72 in Dallas Fort worth 74 in Austin and 76 degrees in Laredo. So here is future track. The key word is mild for today for this afternoon. A little bit cool for tonight, then warmer for tomorrow as this big ridge of high pressure aloft builds into our area. Again, that's a stable air mass building into Texas and the winds crank up for tomorrow as well as for Sunday should be rain free for this weekend. We are watching another front that will enter Texas for the start of next week. Gives a better chance of rain toward the north into central and north Texas. But by Tuesday and Wednesday here in the valley, we're going to put in slight chances for some showers and maybe some thunderstorms here in the valley. That front is expected to stall out, then move back to the north as a warm front and then fizzle out again uh, for Thursday. But all in all, the temperature should be on the warm side a tad above normal for most of next week during the daytime for the highs. On the water, we've got winds out of the southeast at 15 to 20 knots. The bay water is a moderate chop. Next tide is a high tide at 238 this afternoon, and the seas are 2 to 4 feet. So for today, mainly sunny, not too, too humid with a high temperature of 83 degrees. Then for tonight, we'll call it partly cloudy, a mild, even slightly cool night with low temperatures dipping into the mid 60s. Some of you may want a light sweater jacket early tomorrow morning. Others may not need it. 86 degrees for tomorrow. It's muggy, breezy, and it's muggy because the winds really come out of the southeast tomorrow. Gusty winds on Sunday, still humid, even warmer with highs very close to 90. And then the normal high for this time of the year is 85. So temperatures just to add or a tad above normal for next week. We have a slight chance of some showers and thunderstorms next Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. Morning lows back in the lower 70s for next Monday and Tuesday. That's your first Warren 5 forecast. Now here's